Iron Within, Iron Without. I'm Casey Gray, and by audience request, I have 90 seconds to tell you about the Iron Warriors Legion of Chaos Astartes. Of all the heretic legions, the Iron Warriors are probably the least warp influenced. They have a distaste for mutation almost as strong as the Imperium itself, chopping off any body parts that start growing eyes or tentacles, and replacing them with machinery that lacks the weakness of flesh. This is actually kind of convenient for them, since they were probably going to be cutting stuff off and replacing it with cybernetics anyway, so this really just gives them the excuse. They have some real issues with body image and self-confidence. Speaking of, their Primarch Perturabo's life is mostly defined by over-accomplishment and under-appreciation, and even getting a few pats on the head from his dad the Emperor might have been enough to keep him as a loyalist during the heresy. Instead, he and his legion were sent into one meat grinder of a battle after another, while his brother Rogel Dorn got the honor of building the Imperial Palace. Perturabo continued the Emperor's legacy of being a bad father, and after a battle in which his flagship was boarded, he got mad at his sons and sent them all to their room to think about what they'd done. Then he went and built a bunch of murder robots called the Iron Circle to be his bodyguards, because he didn't trust anyone other than himself to do a single thing right. I haven't even gotten to the part where Perturabo builds his own meat grinder fortress specifically to stick it to Dorn and the Imperial Fists, so check out part 2 where I tell you about the whole Iron Cage incident. Hit the like button if hazard stripes are your aesthetic, and declare your loyalty for whatever faction you want to see next.